Hello everybody, welcome to DIY Tuesday. I am so happy that you guys could join us today. We are have, having some amazing sales going on right now. Just in case you haven't seen our website, we are continuing our Black Friday deals from yesterday to today, so go ahead and go check those out, as well as we are offering 50% off of all downloadable products. So go online to our website, check out the digital tab and go to downloadable products. Everything there will be 50% off. So go download those if you haven't because they are there are some really cool classes on there as well as the DIY downloads, which is something that I'm gonna be talking a little bit more about today because we are doing one of the recipes from our holiday download. Now, I'm really excited to show you guys this one. It is one of my favorite recipes from our DIY download. Um, so we have had some questions in terms of, you know, how do I use the lookbook with the download? So I'm gonna tell you really quickly how to do that. So we recommend that you buy the DIY download first. That way you'll be able to know everything that you need in order to do all of your DIY recipes that you're wanting to do in the download. So once you have all of that, go ahead and go on our website, purchase everything that you need, and then you can tack the lookbooks on to your order. You'll also receive one lookbook with every purchase. Um, and when you do that, you'll be able to, you'll get those stickers, the stickers that go on the containers. You'll get that in the lookbook so you'll have everything that you need for your class or DIY project if you're just doing it for yourself. Um, just to let you all know, for those of you who are watching right now, we are giving away today one package of 10 milliliter roller bottles. These do have the multicolored lids. They're adorable and we love them. They make super fun, either just personal use roller bottles or you can even use them for your kids. They love them. So these are what we are giving away today. So make sure you're commenting, liking, and sharing this video for chances to win. We will announce the winner on Friday. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. So today we're gonna be making a stovetop potpourri with essential oils. Now, I'm just gonna be putting it into a container so you can gift it to somebody. You can make this straight on the stove too. All you have to do is just put everything into a pot and it's just really easy. So if you're going to be putting it into a pot, we would recommend about three to four cups of water with these items and then just boil it and it smells heavenly it smells like pie it really does and it's great so if you have a quick event coming up or something that you need a little bit of you know good smelling whatever go ahead and throw this on the stove it's really easy and really simple and it smells amazing so we're gonna go ahead and get started so what I have here is I have about half a cup of fresh cranberries I have about one and a half oranges now it varies because if you're going to be doing just the stovetop version, I would recommend just using one orange. If you are going to be giving it in this jar, I would recommend two oranges just to fill up this space and make it look not as empty. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm, this is literally probably one of the easiest gift ideas in the world. All you have to do is just take the lid off of this and we're gonna just start stuffing the oranges right into here and eventually it's just going to fill all the way up and I've already cut them I would recommend cutting them a little bit thin um, that way you'll have more and okay so I'm just going to stuff the rest of these in here okay so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my cranberries on top so I'm just going to dump these in here, see if I cannot make a mess, because we all know that I am a famous mess maker. Perfect. So then what I would recommend doing, because you still have the essential oils that you need to put in, is I would recommend either you can really honestly just drop them straight onto the cranberries, or you can provide them with a sample vial of the oil or whatever you want to. But what we're going to do is we're going to do one drop of clove and one drop of cinnamon. So I'm gonna just put that right on top here. And then it also calls for an eighth of a teaspoon of nutmeg. So I'm gonna take my nutmeg here and I'm just gonna put an eighth of a teaspoon and you can really just put it right on top like I said. And then all they have to do 
is boil their water and dump this straight into the water. They don't probably shouldn't dump it into boiling water. They should probably put this in first and then boil the water afterwards. But it looks super festive and it's really cute. Um, super easy guys. It took us less than five minutes to make this. So it's a really good on the go recipe if you're just wanting to make something really fast for a friend, family member, whatever. Um, it already smells really good and I haven't even, you know, put it on the stove or anything. But it's a really fast recipe. Um, just for those of you who are just joining us, make sure that you're commenting and liking this video because we are giving away a package of 10 milliliter multicolored roller bottles today. And um, so that giveaway will end on Friday. So make sure that you are doing that and you'll have time to enter before then. So that is all that we have for you guys today. Don't forget to check out our website. We do have those Cyber Monday deals that have been extended. So check those out and we will see you on Friday.